Salutations, everyone, and welcome to 2020, January 5th, in which we're going to have a great, great year. But right now, we are poised to strike actually into the PRC. No, we did the PRC yesterday, last episode, in which we took out the People's Republic of China, which now they're fully under us in the befriending Italy. Okay, whatever. Um, and cooperate with the EU? It's not a bad idea. At least you didn't condemn the USSR. That's pretty good, I would say, for us. Oh, we're going to got a few comments to go through, but let's go ahead and head on to here. Uh, the it just says Korea, the Democratic People's Republic of Korea. Ah, uh, well, strengthen our borders, cooperate, corporate cooperation, supply focus. I think it's time to put them under new management. So now, actually, we're going to go ahead and call our allies in, which is probably going to ruin supply. But hey, whatever. Does anyone want to join? Oh, here we go. We actually have to get the, the Chinese in here too. Because, well, we're kind of using them as a land border. The only border we actually have is over here, so. We'll see what happens. Alexander, do you have any upgrades for us? No, hopefully it doesn't take too long to go to war with these guys. We'll see what happens. We already have a lot of our ships already here, and. Someone's moving up here, I guess? Hello, who's snaking? Snaky? Snaky snake, where are you? Hello, sir. Where, seriously, where are you? Oh, hello. Oh, we got some subs coming in. Okay. The United States. The United People States clear one the. Belizean, what the heck happened here? Oh, look at this, they changed the flag. Jeff Mackler, who, okay, so America's getting involved in Mexico and Central America. Well, I guess they're doing more stuff than what the US does normally in real life, but global confederacy. Now, I don't play Red Roll that much, but um, global confederacy. Mm. You say confederacy, and I got my thoughts already drifting towards one type of confederacy. And I don't think they're very socialist, but maybe that's just me. Cool. Uh, I would like to attack, but honestly, attacking over the river into anywhere here is probably a really bad idea. Uh, I already set up, as you can see, some naval invasions around here, too. Uh, we might have to actually go ahead and do this instead. If that's the case, and no one wants to help us attack, let's see. Let's take you th three. Come from Vladivostok, and maybe we get Busan. That'd be kind of nice, probably, right? Busan's kind of nice this time of year. Where are you guys at? Where are you guys at? Both of you guys, come over here. Come over here. And go right there. See what we can do. Now, some people, some things have been sunk. Uh, P uh, Korean convoys. Two to three million manpower. A lot of divisions, probably quite a good... Eh, that's not bad for stockpiles. Artillery's a little bit lacking, but that's all right. Uh, the Chinese have already been called into the war. Yeah, I just, I don't want to really try to attack because they're so stacked. So many stacks, man. So many stacks. I mean, it looks like we're doing well with that stuff. Uh, let's take a look over here. Actually, we got, ma we're maxed out on planes. Holy cow. If that's the case. Um, we got plenty of fighters. Not too worried about that. We can throw 100 fighters over here, too. That's fine. Just on the Korean Peninsula. It's fine. And bombers, drones. We got a few drones here and there. That's not bad. The BADs. Go right here, go right here, go right here. And we'll do Korea, too. See what we can do. I'm just sort of... I wanted to go to war with Japan first, but we'll see what happens, obviously. Um, and we do have naval supremacy. Or at least we should have naval supremacy, so... Hey, there we go. Sinking some convoys. Actually, what's our navy like? I can't imagine it be that strong. Yeah, screens and some subs. That's not too bad. Not great. And we're slowly blowing up their destroyers. And subs. Pretty good. We got five days left. Not too bad, not too bad. Alexander, he's done, he did a great job against the PRC yesterday. Oh, wow, they're sinking everything we got down here. Where are my capital ships? Guys, what are you doing? Where, 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 oh, you're down there? Why are you down there still? No, 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 come up here. Come on. Get with the time, son. I'm going to throw you against the Japanese and probably won't go very well for any of us, but that's okay. Uh, at least we're sinking some ships. Yeah, I don't think we could bust over there. I mean, maybe if we use, you know, um, tanks over here. But they're, they're, our allies have death stacked so hard that it just would not probably be possible. I mean, can we attack here? Probably not. Yeah, I mean, slowly we're, our soldiers are getting quite drained. Yeah, we're going to naval invade. That sucks. That's all right, though. We got to do what we got to do, right? Oh, here we go. Hopefully we don't lose these tanks. Actually, is there one over here? Maybe, maybe not. Oh, there is someone over there. Even if we can't get this yet, we can just cut these guys off pretty quickly by cutting through here with our tanks, so... And it's only a single division. Hopefully we go okay. Hopefully the Italians naval invade too, because last time we tried to naval invade, it was 
Oh, hello. Can they pierce our armor? No, they cannot. Get those boys on there. Aircraft carrier 2018 fighter variants. Well, all I can say is that it's 2020. End game right now, and as I'm recording this. So we'll see what happens. <sighs> okay, okay. Nice. Sunk some more destroyers. Good. Sink those destroyer dudes. Good. Actually, if anything, you guys could probably just race down there, and you're just going to help take these guys out. That should pretty much guarantee us victory right here. Yep, and I knew it. Got it. Awesome. Everyone, come on over. Now take out Korea from its southern port. Boom, boom. Which is a pretty good tune. And then you do that. There you go. Go right on in. Good, good, good. And that might divert soldiers away from here, which would be good. They're going to take us like crazy. We might also just try to invade. Ooh, ooh. Hello. Uh, Japan as well. We'll give us a little bit more time first. Oh, hello. Look at this. Oh, look at this going on. Oh, yes, please. Uh, what are the comments yesterday said? Uh, at the time of this recording, Kaiser Redux is updated, so you don't need... Uh, so, like, check it out some more. Uh, yeah, I will. I will check out Kaiser Redux. There's just too many mods out there. And never enough time. So, uh, let's see. Go to... We're not going to get through the terror focus. I just did Naval Doctrine 2's for the assessment of the Soviet's Navy doctrine has resulted in more requests for revision. Let's go support Italy. Investments in the country and more meetings with Italian delegations will solidify our influence there. Cool. Uh, I love naval combat so much. I know I'm a very weird one when I say this, but I love the naval combat. Or it's just, I just love blowing up enemy ships. That's really what I love. Uh, we actually might be able to win there now. Yeah. Uh. We already have the PRC, so what do we just try to butt attack them? By butt attack them, just like throw a guy in the line. Because we have over 7 million soldiers ready to go, so... There you go, good luck. Probably not going to go well. Air XP should be going up, though. Especially if we've got enough breakthrough. And our tanks down here doing a good job. Love it. Throw them in, have a good time. Have a good, 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 good time. We can break over the river here. That would just have a triple effect going all the way through here, probably. Ooh, even over on, on the edges. On the edges where we got them. We're going to win, hopefully. Hopefully. Come on. Hey, look at that. We cut these guys off. Beautiful. Really good. There you go. Help them out. Oh, you're heading down here? That's fine with me. Wasn't it in TNO that they actually have a, la an, uh, a connection between here and Busan or Southern Korea from Kyushu? That'd be kind of cool. Nice. What's going on? Oh. Japan, though, I, I'm sure will be a little bit more difficult than this, so. Head on over here, too. Alright, just send in the tanks. Just maybe invade using your tanks and you take Seoul. Oh, so wait, Seoul's the capital of this. Not even Pyongyang. You know, I thought Pyongyang would be the capital of this type of Korea, but you know what? Sometimes I can be very wrong about things. We've lost 30,000 soldiers while we killed off, well, 150,000. Quite literally, 150,000. Oh, look at this. This is beautiful. Oh. Oh, yeah. Mr. Krabs. Oh. Maybe we should stop attacking these guys. We busted over the river, so that's not too bad. Just other tanks or whatever. Kind of hang out, have a good time. You know, the good stuff. Okay, Song. Hey, I want do we actually have South Korea here? No, we don't have South Korea. Oh, it's just one big old Korea. Actually, no, this is actually kind of nice. The developers for Red World Fan Fork divided Korea up into more different states. I actually kind of like that, but I prefer that, actually. Even though it probably makes the game just like lag slightly worse, it doesn't even matter. But instead of like having just South Korea and North Korea, the actual Korea has more tiles, which is very, very nice, I'd say. Very, 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 very nice. Help them out. Okay. I keep seeing Confederacy, and I'm very interested now. Oh, Granada. Granada? Yeah, okay. Cool. Very cool. St. Lu Lucian State? You say Lucian. And I instantly think of League of Legends for some reason. That was Lucius. Is it Lucius? Lucian? I can't remember. I never played with him. Mr. Shooty Guns. Cool. But yeah, I do plan on playing some more Kaiser Redux. I do plan on playing this mod some more, Red World. It's interesting. It doesn't seem really extremely fleshed out yet. I know this is still being worked on at the time of this recording, so... I do want to try out other countries, so we'll see what happens. We'll definitely see what happens. And... Cuba? Okay. Well, I guess keep moving. You know, in any scenario, I guess America just got to take out everyone that's around them. Regardless if 
what they believe in. If America's socialist, they want to take out the rest of the continents in the Western Hemisphere. Sounds good. If they're anarcho-capitalists, I don't think I've ever played as anarcho-capitalist USA. Maybe that's just normal USA. Not really, no, it's not. If we had anarcho-capitalist USA, how would that even work? It doesn't matter. Just America wants to take out everything. And you know what? We will be right back, or I will see you when we can go to war with Japan. Well, here we are, my friends, and it's now time, I guess, to do another focus, shall we? We just supported Italy and had a good time, but you know what's something a lot of fun to do? Exploiting the Congo. The resources of the Congo will be a great asset for a nation. Yes, I love the Congolese Union. Oh, what a great bunch of people down there. We're totally not going to exploit Joseph Kabilia. Kabilia, Kabila, glory to the state, regardless. Ah, uh, I need more divisions? Oh, yes, some of these guys. And we're pretty much ready to go ahead and go to war with the Japanese. Uh, and call it a campaign after that. Let's see, we got some more drones waiting to go kaboom. And we have some naval bombers as well, finally. Actually, I'm going to do this, that, and then one more. So we have 300 guys here. One, two, go right there. And then you guys go right there. Let's give it about five more seconds, and then we'll go on. Because the Japanese, the Japanese, I'm going to assume that the Kochikai faction... Okay, I was assuming they had a much better fleet than that. Never mind. Okay, let's just go to war. They have 16 million manpower. Wow. Alright. We go to war. We have a good time. You know, you, me, and... Well, they're not war crimes because, well, no one really cares. It's only war crimes if people care about it. And America's struggling down in Mexico, but, hey, I'm sure they'll finish up. It's only May 2020. Can we w finish this war by the end of the year? Oh, look at this. Oh, we have land over here. I forgot about this. That's a lot of artillery. That is, uh, that's a lot of artillery. Oh, wow. Another tank division. Don't mind if we do. All right. Are we ready to go in? Actually, we're bombing their ships. I'm actually a little disappointed in the Japanese. I thought they'd have a bigger navy than this, but... Oh, well. Oh, they have a lot of divisions on the... Ooh, we might not be able to naval invade correctly yet. Ooh, that's not good, man. Oh, regardless, let's see. Fighters and fighters. Let's duplicate that. Get some more fighters going over there. It looks like we're struggling a little bit with air superiority. So, that's alright. The Japanese, yeah. Okay, so their task forces obviously are not very good. Especially once you get your carriers involved and our battleships, dreadnoughts, you know. The good stuff. I love naval combat so much. Oh, the comments. Ooh, we are definitely trying to attack here, aren't we? Uh, force the attack. If you can't land, then there's no point to even use them. So... Uh, you don't need to invade the U.S. Yes. I'm not going to invade the U.S. in this campaign. There's no point to you, like I said. There's already enough war over there. Uh, there is a comment, though, whenever I play as the American Republic, for reform the United States of America, and then invade Russia or the Soviet Union. Uh, yeah, uh, prob I probably will do that, actually, cause, just because you can. So, we'll see what happens. We'll definitely see what happens. Yeah, sinking a lot of convoys. Come on, guys. you got to win. you got to win. Uh, anyone? Oh, these guys have lost a lot of strength so far. As you can see, I'm trying to navel invade in a lot of different places here. Help them out, help them out, put them down. There we go. I should guarantee us more of a victory here. There we go. Especially in Nagasaki. So see, we're not. Oh, look at that. Nice. Good job, guys. Let's get down there. Great. And. Let them get in here. And. Well, I guess we're all, all already here. Cool. Head on in. How about the... Alright, how many men have we lost? Uh, how many divisions are going this way? Just one... Oh, that's fine. Oh, we've cut off over 200,000 of them. The French state has done a very, very nice job, I would say, so far. We're good, guys. We're good. If you guys like to go that way, that'd be fine. How many divisions do they have? They have 205. That's quite a few. And Adrian was killed. Well, that's not good. She's smiling when she died, apparently. But these divisions are... Hold on. Let's take a look. Let's take a look. A lot of manpower, but... Uh, they got a good amount of equipment. Not bad, not bad. Okay, so they've one motorized infantry, two anti air. I think that's one combat width and two artillery. So basically, motorized infantry is two. Two artillery would make it a total of eight because each are three. So eight. That's ten combat width. Um, AI might need to get looked at, but then again, I just said it's the AI that might need to get looked at. This is, of course, still Holy Four, so what do you expect? You know, uh, I'll have you guys just come on down here. And send one guy to go actually down here. That's fine. There you go. Good luck. If you guys would like, you guys would just stay there. There you go. Nice. Good. Good. Ah, just overran them. Overrun them. We might have to naval invade again, but that's fine. I don't really care. It's not too hard to naval invade here. It really just is not. 
Yeah, they're tr definitely trying a more of an artillery challenge here. It's fine with me, but... No, China, we don't need you right now. I mean, you keep going if you want. That's fine with me. I don't really care. Uh, good. Good. Oh, they're, yeah, they're literally just dying down here. I like it. I like it a lot. I'm kind of surprised no one else is trying to naval invade either. Maybe they are. Maybe I'm just not paying attention. No, they're still defending over there. Uh, a lot of losses for the Japanese fleets. But then again, I mean, it's not they're not that strong. So, how many Japanese people have died? Oh, uh, over 600,000. That's not bad. Not bad. We could do a little better than that, though. Give us some time, and we'll go ahead and attack them. My goodness, they are attacking like a bunch of crazy... Look at that. Look how much their strength just... They're melting because they just don't have enough strength. All right, let's rev up those engines, I guess. And, uh, well, we're using some future tanks. Let's see. Yeah, future tanks. We don't have a lot of. Some main battle tanks. We got 5.7 thousand, so that's pretty good. And good luck, guys. We might need it. We might literally have to naval invade. But then again, with what they're doing, they might be doing last stand, perhaps? I don't know. And we're done with our air doctrine. Great. Yeah, I think they, they, they got to be doing last stand, right? Because their organization's literally not even going down, so... Hmm. Hmm. Oh, big sadness. All right, well, whatever. Do the same thing, and come on right there. And then, one, two, three, that should be good enough. Cut these guys off, go right here, and then invade. Oh, I don't know, it doesn't really matter to me. Right there? Sure. Just go whenever you can, it doesn't really matter. Actually, don't actually don't go ahead. I mean, this is the last episode, anyways. But still, uh, what's over here? Not much, actually. Not much. That's good. Air doctrine's almost done. Naval stuff. Let's grab some smoke generators because we can. Very good. And we still haven't broken across, but whatever. Uh, we should be crushing a lot of guys by doing this. I'd like to, you know, force the attack a little bit more. It is still active. That's good. Go ahead, do that. 88. Now I went back down to 75. Escort patrols. Grab some of this. That'd be nice. Any more sub action? Yes, we do. Cancel. Good. You guys go there. You guys go ahead and start sinking the crap out of the enemies. Mm, artillery? No, we're done. Infantry? We're pretty much done too. Mechanized? Why not? And better drones? Better drones. Agent Nikolai Nebogatov. Nebogatov. Now our ships are getting sunk. Whatever, whatever. Oh, yeah. Losing quite a few guys, but they... They honestly should be losing a lot more, actually. Because even though these tanks are doing great right now, they're still doing okay. we got two days left, then we'll naval invade up here. We should be okay. There you go. Completely surround the islands of Japan. They cannot import anything else, and hopefully they get crushed. So you guys are stuck down here. Fine, whatever. Let's go. Let's go, boys. Oh. There we go. Split the Congo. Don't mind if we do. I love Africa. And support France. Investments in the country will, and more meetings with the French delegations will solidify our influence there. Very good. Alright, so this is not going great for us, but honestly, they have a lot of manpower. They might not even be stationing this area anymore for some reason, which would be okay with us. And we're sinking pretty much the entire Japanese fleet, which is very pathetic. That's okay with us. Uh, who needs Marines when you got future and modern tanks? There you go. Nice. I got supplies for them immediately. Help them out. Put them out of the misery. There you go. Alright, so this is a really bad idea, but here we go. Everyone come on over. And we'll strike from the north. They want us to help us down there. So be it. So be it. You guys actually just hang out up, up here. Wait, what? No, no, no. There you go. There you go. Ah, good. Oh, we're trying to attack down here too. I forgot about that too. Hmm. Even if we win, we're just going to abandon the area anyway, so. Go right ahead. Have a good time. See you later. Just kind of hold. Literally, don't even give them an order. They'll do fine over here, so. Ah, oh, Japan, you should have just submitted. And I'm going to keep attacking. I don't care what happens over here. I really don't. 
I know attacking over a waterway isn't smart with the tanks, but at the same time, they should still do their job. The French are doing quite well. How much does it cost for us to do this? 57, that's not bad. Alright, let's take a look. Alright, so I have 120 divisions. I got three things of engineers, which is literally, literally just four combat with it, which is a bit crazy. Anything else? 80,000 guns, probably more like 150,000 some. Uh, they broke our ciphers, no one cares. They got plenty of artillery. Planes, not so much. Some naval you have. Lots of support equipment. Alright, whatever. Anything else around here? More subby wubbies. And you guys, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Alexander, you got anything else for us? Uh, not really. Nothing of interest. And then you guys, Sergei? No, not really, too. Okay. Whatever. You guys are doing a fine job. Not too worried about this. Dude, actually, if you guys could get in there and circle that, that'd be great. The convoys go bye bye. You guys go bye bye, too. Ah, to see the Tons eventually showed up. That's nice. Actually, part of the problem is that we'll probably not have enough uh, ground damage yet. You guys, where are the bombers? You're the fighters. Fighters, fighters, never bombers, never bombers. Drones. Oh, we must be out of drones. Yeah, we didn't make enough, uh, basically, tactical bombers this campaign. It's alright, though. Whatever. I just want to force the attack. Kill these enemies off. That's not enough for the amount of casualties we've taken. It's not enough, man. Convoy sunk. That's good stuff. These guys are cut off, which is good stuff as well. Come on, Andre. Does he have any upgrades, actually? There's a hill spider. That's kind of nice. Are we learning anything, Dimitri? No? Okay. Hey, we took Tokyo. Nice. These guys should not be able to stand up for that much longer. They don't have that much supply down here, so... Come on, guys. Seriously? You're making us look bad. Go ahead and grab some of this. Bracket shooting. Enjoy shooting brackets. Oh, look, they took Okinawa. Good job. Italy's, Italy's not doing too bad. I like I like Italy a little bit more. Maybe not in other mods, but Red World? Not bad. Sri Lanka is ready to go. What about the Japanese? Let's do the Japanese again. Because we love the Japanese. We love them so much, we want them to become a part of us. And how's America doing? Well, they're getting... They're really, they're, they haven't moved in Mexico. Wow. Sucks to be American right now. I still only August. We'll have them before the war's over. We'll be home by Christmas, but everyone, we'll be home by Christmas. At least that's what I'm telling the uh, the families of the soldiers. They'll be home by Christmas. Absolutely, absolutely. Uh, 19% uh, war sports. Barely get any daily command power. That sucks. Force the attack. Look at that. They're literally fighting the last man. Ah, oh, we're close to it. Industrial advancements. Um, they still got a good amount of equipment, but they've lo they've lost like at least thirty thousand pieces of, of infantry equipment, so that's good. Uh, casualties: they've suffered one point three million. We've suffered one hundred fifteen thousand, so could be worse. Could be a lot worse. It is what it is. I did put some naval bombers up here too. So, come on, guys, seriously, you're making us look so god awful right now. Uh, come on, Italians, can't you help out? I mean, it's not bad. They just lost 30,000 more soldiers, so. Oh, come on. I said we'd be home by Christmas. It's only September, but still. Go in, go in. So they should be having fewer... Ah, there we go. Fewer and fewer air bases. Now we get even more damage in the game here. That's nice. We still can't invade, though. Big sadness. What do we need left? Osaka? Is that it? Hopefully that's it. Technically, we do have this area up here as well, but... Oh, actually, we have five tanks up here. I hate waterways, man. Doesn't matter what mod. Uh, no, Osaka doesn't seem like it. That's the real goal. Nice, these guys have been cut off. Completely, actually. So you guys actually might not be able to win. Oh, we actually broke... Oh, it only took us, like, a couple months. There we go. I told you we'd be home by Christmas, but... Um, I guess... That's probably going to be it for the campaign. There's really not much else to do here. I mean, the focuses are cool and all, but there's really not much here. We support France. We can cooperate with the Nationals, which hurts us with, with you know, less political power. Oh, we have... Oh. The Communists of Japan are ready to strike. The revolution is near. 
Oh yeah, they're already gone. We could start with Iran or the Saudis and get some oil exports. But other than that, there's really not much else here to do. So, if you enjoy this campaign, please consider leaving a like. Subscribe if you are, of course, new here, which I doubt you are. Uh, check out my Discord link and hang out with me if you really would like to, because I'm, not, well, I'm often on the Discord link anyways, or my Discord server. But regardless, thank you very much for watching, I do appreciate it, and I hope you guys have a great, great rest of your day.